startups that are not integrated into technology and fashion together will face difficulties in adapting to the new demands of the markets. So these startups really need to uh, uh, be integrated into technology so that maybe investors will want to invest in their startup. And startups that are not integrated within the technology will not uh, get the investment that they are looking for. It's very important at the same time to just look at all of the choices when it comes to technology and make sure you make the best out of each one of it because um, there's a lot happening and new technologies uh, you know, coming out every day. So it's uh, also good not to just be taken within design and retail and also think of the production process of how you can save time, uh, which is also saving money. Uh, and um, I mean, and the more you know about technology, the more you can get like uh, the process going smoothly and have a uh, better finish at the end. First tip is like investment. When it comes to investment, it's like uh, a school homework. You really need to do your homework very well to prepare when you want to get uh, your funding uh, for, uh, for you to be able to, uh, to secure the funding and to succeed. So prepare well for your investment fundraising cycle. Second tip, basically you really need to uh, research about your investors. When you want to approach investors, uh, do your homework on them. Uh, see if they, uh, they really fit your business, your sector. Uh, the type of funding that they, uh, they're going to uh, give you if, if they fit within your uh, fundraising phase. So it's very important also to, uh, uh, to know your investor very well. The third tip is uh, fail. You have to fail for you to be able to succeed. Try to fail as much as you can. Don't, don't be afraid of failure. And uh, don't be afraid if you got rejected by investors because if, if they don't, uh, invest in you now, they might invest with you at a later stage.